Hey everyone, my name is Ben Barker and I'm the Applications Engineer for Xylem's Online Analytical Instrumentation. And I'm Justin King, Product Manager for Xylem's Online Instrumentation. We are here today to introduce our newest online analyzer from YSI, the 3017M Chlorine DPD Analyzer. The 3017M is a color metric analyzer for the continuous measurement of free or total chlorine, which can help you monitor and control your chlorination process. So Justin, tell me a little bit more about the 3017M we have here. Yeah, so the 3017M was actually developed in College Station, Texas, and is manufactured right here in Yellow Springs, Ohio. Let's get into it. So as you can see, this chlorine analyzer has a large, easy to read display that allows you to quickly see your chlorine measurements. Because of the onboard display, it can be used as a standalone analyzer or it can be integrated into a network of process instruments like our IQ sensor net network. Sounds great. So can you tell me a little bit more about how it works? What type of sample requirements do we have for this analyzer? Of course, so the 3017M actually has very little sample requirements. For example, you don't need to worry about pressure or flow when setting up this analyzer. As long as you have a continuous sample flow within three feet of the instrument, the 3017M will do the rest. So here we have the peristaltic sample pump. We've designed it to continuously flow throughout the normal operation of this instrument. We've done this for two main reasons. One, it ensures the flow cell has been completely rinsed out between measurements. And two, it helps keep all the components of the flow cell cleaner for longer periods of time. Okay. So DPD analyzers require mixing of sample with reagents. How is this done in the 3017M? Yeah, so this analyzer actually uses flow injection analysis and a static mixer to mix the sample with the reagents. Flow injection analysis injects the reagents into a continuously flowing sample stream and the static mixer efficiently mixes the solution without any moving parts. Very cool. So with wet chemistry analyzers like this, maintenance is very important. Can you tell us what type of maintenance is required to keep this analyzer running smoothly? Yeah, of course. So with no moving parts in the mixing process, a continuously flowing sample flow to keep the flow cell clean, and the analyzer actually being factory calibrated, there are only two routine maintenance activities. These are changing out the DPD reagents each month and changing the peristaltic tubing around every six months. And that's really it. Okay, so how do we ensure this analyzer is reading accurately? Great question. So DPD analyzers are commonly validated by other chlorine measurement methods. This can be done with handheld colorimeters or various techniques used in the laboratory to determine chlorine residuals. What kind of accuracy can we expect from the 3017M? The DPD method is an extremely accurate and reliable method for chlorine analysis. And the 3017M in particular is accurate within plus or minus 0.03 milligrams per liter. So where would we use an analyzer like this? Yeah, that's a great question, Ben. The 3017M is perfect for drinking water and wastewater applications. It's used to monitor and control chlorine dosing and disinfection processes in both of these applications. Oh, so is the 3017M EPA approved for reporting? Actually, yes it is. So the 3017M can be used for reporting in drinking water and wastewater applications. It follows standard method 4500 CLG, US EPA method 334, and it's ISO compliant following method 7393-2. So are there any other applications where we might be able to use the 3017M? Yeah, so this analyzer can actually be used in industrial applications for monitoring cooling tower disinfection. It can also be used to monitor aquatic habitats like zoos and aquariums. Well, great. Thanks, Justin, for that introduction to the 3017M. Can you tell everyone where we can find more information? Yeah, so for more information, please visit our website at ysi.com forward slash 3017M. Thank you for watching.